And welcome back, everybody. All right, we're going to the sixth floor now, Castle McFrights. Next part of our walkthrough. Finished up the basement, first, second, third, fourth, and fifth floors completely with all of the gems, except for one gem on the fourth floor that we can't get to yet. So Castle McFrights time. This is a great stage, great floor. I imagine the gold starts ramping like Bant here in a floor or two. Yeah, I may need to start getting some more some more gold to get this A rank. And that's the only thing that the ranking checks is how much gold you have at the end. It doesn't matter how many gems or boos you get. You don't actually have to get any of the gems or boos to still get an A rank. See, there's a couple dollars there. There's a bat with some dollars. So we're, we're at 14,000. Castle McFrights. That's a treasure chest. Let me get that treasure chest. Probably an easy way to get to that. I think we do. I think we get there later on, I think. Yeah, I don't think we get there right away. Oh no, a gate! What will I ever do? Gooigi! Fit through that gate. Nope. Grab. Grab. <laughs> there we go. Alright, so Gooigi can pull the gate open for us. Maybe do we go around this way? Oh, I bet we have Gooigi. Come on over here. I bet Gooigi can go through this part. There we go. Chest. Alright, good job, Gooigi. Teleport. Alright, start breaking stuff, because... Break stuff, you get gold. Everybody knows that. Break stuff, get gold. There's no knight over here. That means it's hidden. Secret knight. Alright, so the secret knight has our first gem. Red gem. Which is a sword. Okay. Uh, let's see. Next. This is pretty sweet. This boss fight... Never get to it. it. Took me a long time to figure this out. I spent like you know 20, 30 minutes just doing the boss fight without even hurting him, trying to figure out how to possibly hurt him. Wow. Get out of the way. We got a treasure chest back there. Treasure chest. Can we go this way? I don't think you can. Can you? No. I don't know why we have all these watermelons. People probably threw away some some gold, right? Probably just in the trash can. Yeah. Or just throws away gold. Makes sense. Well, I guess we can't go through there either. Oh, we gotta go see the cutscene first. This boss is cool. He's, he's like, come and get it. Pretty cool boss. Ah, 
goes. Ah, just four life. You usually use your black light and see the ghosts also. Ah, all these right there. All right. Y'all know something different about that wall? Looks a little out of place, doesn't it? Secret. Second gem. Purple one. Okay. So I'm sure this. I'm sure, we gotta pull this lever for something. Ah. All right. So those are spikes. Luigi cannot handle spikes, but Gooigi. This is a good Gooigi level. these spikes just fine same thing here spikes and now pull this down pull the spikes down hold that there Tomato. Is there a secret door back here? Sweet. Treasure chest. Alright, getting his health down. So I want a two shot. So I want to just keep dragging him and dragging the health down. Two shot. Yeah. RMO, hey. All right. So there we go. Yeah, Luigi's Mansion 3. This game came out this past fall. Ah, got a shield. So we're going to have to shoot it. Bunch of ghosts in here. Yeah, we're doing we're doing a complete walkthrough. Getting all the gems. We'll get all the booze at the end. Then get an A rank. We're gonna beat the game completely. The goal is like uh, 10, 12 hours, something like that. I guess I don't really have a specific time goal. I'm trying to do it quickly. This door that we have right here needs a key. That door right, you know, right there, that's that's actually needs a key. But first, we're gonna keep on breaking these things open. Because this one has a, a gem in it. Maybe it doesn't look like it, but there's a secret passage right here. Climb the ladder. Gem. Secret gem. 
Yeah, we're kind of speed running. I'm trying, I'm trying to like speed run, but then also a rank or a a rank. You have to get all this gold, so it takes like some time to get all sorts of gold. <laughs> it's okay, Aromo. You're good. Yep, that's, that's what we're trying to do. Ha having some fun today. Okay. So again, Guiji doesn't care about the spikes. This one over here. Yeah, there we go. Secret trap door. Found that. We got a flame. We can pick up this torch. Okay, so we gotta drop the torch. Flame didn't last too long. There we go. Put the flame in the torch. Torch up these cobwebs. We can go to this side. We can drop the torch now. No, I don't want the torch. I'm trying to get the money. Not the torch. Alright, and then pull this lever. <laughs> Luigi, we're going up. Ladder up to the second part. And there we go. See, this is a fun little place. Yeah, the pure green Luigi is, is called Gooigi. It's this goo that you have in your backpack there that you can make come out. And basically be like your little uh, helper. So, like we have in Gooigi bring up this elevator. Now we're gonna have Gooigi put the elevator down. All right, the single the single hardest um, ge gem for me in the whole game, Gooigi, come on back down here, was this gem right here. This gem took me. Oh, I, I don't even know how much time. You know, an hour, two. I couldn't. I could not figure out how to get this gem in because you know I tried every single little thing in this room and you know like everything. I couldn't figure. You know, like with this ladder, ever you know, focus everything. The one, how to get it, and what I didn't see, is there's actually up there on the wall. There's a fan right there, and that fan just kind of blended in, and I just never saw it, and I could not. You know, I was so focused on everything on the right hand side. Um, up at the top of the level and everything. And yeah, it's just this this fan over here. You just have to use it and, and bring it down. Go get it. I could not figure out how to get that. Alright. So let's see, go through here. Nope, locked. We need, to, need another key. Ellie. That was probably the hardest gem for me to find. And that, the, I guess that one and, and the, the level th the third floor gem that we talked about with the vending machine, those two, I spent a considerable amount of time trying to figure those two out. All right. These are, ah, those are arrows. We cannot get shot. Here, you can go get shot too easy. All right, um, all right, so we need to pull this. To make that partly fall. And now Guiji, get the other one. To make that fall. And now you can go across. Because Guiji can't cross the water. Because he wants to cross water, Guiji dies. Let's get some of this gold up here. Walk 
right across here. Alright, got the key. Baby smashers. Cool little puzzle. All right, so so we need that key, of course. This this door is like you need a key. I'm like, all right, well, I can't get through, so Luigi. But then water. So then you're like, well, that doesn't work either. All right, so we need Luigi to pull this thing door. And hold that there. And now Mario can go through the water. Grab the key. No! They dumped the water on Gooigi. We're trapped. Gooigi, go save us. Go get rid of these ghosts. Oh, we got a twofer. See, the walls are closing in. Go, Gooigi, go. That was a good twofer. I was a lot closer the first time I did it. There's gold. We're at 15,000. Look at those eyes. Look how freaky those eyes were. Was like looking at us. Alright, what does this do? Alright, opens that up. So, Luigi, you go over here. Blow on this. Go the other way. You need to line up this bridge. Hmm. Let's go. How are we going to do this? Oh, okay, actually, I figured it out. Alright, so we're going to go right here. Now let's go the other way. Perfect. Okay, look at these eyes. You know, they just follow us. Ah! Uh. Ooh, ran through that. Looks like there's some gold if I would fall down. Hey, what's up, Brad? Okay, we got some more. Some more shooty things. We don't want any shooty things. What does this do? Just put some more. Go cover those up. We need to turn this into a cart. Alright, turn that into a cart. Go 
coming on over here, cart. Come on, cover these guys up. Perfect. Good job, Luigi. Little guys. Pretty easy. Okay. We're getting closer to the boss. How many gems have we gotten so far? Oh, we already got four gems? Okay. So there's two more. I know there's one here and okay, yeah, I know, I know we're there. Yeah. Ah, run! There's one right here. Get out of here, bat. No, bat, no. No, not right there. Right here, the big, big one. Secret door. The Royal Coffers. Give me all that gold. And the green sword. Y'all do anything? No? Alright. And here we go. Let's get those final boss emotes in the chat. I guess they're just regular boss emotes, but yep. Final boss for this level. For this floor. Boss time. This is a cool boss. And then again, I need y'all's ratings. So it's a king that does all the fighting himself. That's pretty good. But then his people are just cardboard. Ow. So like how to actually do damage to this this guy I couldn't figure out for the longest. But basically it's So yeah, it's whenever he I mean I just made it look like super easy. But like I said, I'd spend probably 20, 30 minutes on this fight before I could even figure that out. The only time you can you can ever hurt him is he whenever he does his Um Oh, really? Whenever he charges at you and he like does like a jump thrust and then you can do your um, light in his face. So like he charges at you like right there. That's the only time. Every other, like everything else with every tactic he's invincible. And I tried every other tactic and I, I didn't really just even think, you know, it took me a long time to figure, to, you know, think of that of shine the light right then. Cause, you know, I tried, I tried everything. And I was like using my glow light everywhere. Ah. But yeah, you couldn't see. Yeah, that's the only time like the flashlight blinding him works is whenever he goes up like that over the over the thing. But I didn't really see that visually at first while I was trying to figure out everything else. Like a shield will block it. I wanted to get that hard, but he's in the way. Uh. All right, two shot him. Get some more health down. That's up this gold. Get this up. Ah, run away. Yeah, you know, from here it's easy, but it was just like figuring out how to get hit him at all at first it was really tough. This game's pretty sweet. So now we're gonna keep on having interesting levels. We just had the music level. Now this this level, a couple stage levels in a row. 
At first, they were just like generic hotel levels. That doesn't look like a seven. It looks like a one. So he was just, that uh, soldier was just holding the last castle gem. All right, castle gem's done. That's the sixth floor. Hey, Snake Spur, doing good. <laughs> yeah, it looks like, why are we going back to the first floor? But no, it's it's the seventh, yeah, it's the seventh floor up. Elevator button, but it looks like the sixth floor one. All right, Gooigi needs to pull this for, for Luigi. All right, another level done. Another floor done. And we'll do the last part. All right, there's floor number seven. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What's our floor number seven going to be? Garden Suites. All right, y'all watching on YouTube. Thank you so much. And click on over to the next part of our Luigi 100% walkthrough with the Garden Suites. All right, see you over there.